These are the zipper pouched planners or zipper closure planners that I had not seen um, when I came in here prior to Christmas. So these are the different covers that they have for them. So here is the sticker collection. And they're having a sale and coupons and everything right now. So I'm on my lunch break and I'm a little overwhelmed with all the choices. So it's hard for me to make choices under pressure and when I'm on a time limit. So I'm going to have to come back and see what stickers or anything else I might want to add to my planner. So I just went to Michael's with my gift card that I got for Christmas from my husband and the kids to get my planner for 2017. So now I'm going to show you my mini Michael's haul. First I have the Jelly Roll gold shadow pen. So they're supposed to write gold in the middle and then with the color that's on the cap on the outside. And those were on sale from, oh, I got the 50% off coupon I was able to use with those. So that's what it was. It was $9.99, marked down 50%. Next, I got the Projects book. And I'm not going to add this to any planner. I'm just going to carry it as is. But this is solely for house projects and things I'm trying to finish up for the year. Next, I have the projects book, which I'm using um, for the projects around the house for this year, um, because hopefully we'll get the house on the market this year. So there's a lot of things that I want to do, even if we end up not selling it, just things that I want to do to improve on the house. So on the first page, the first page tells you you are capable of amazing things. You have year at a glance and your key and reoccurring tasks then you have your monthly tasks descriptions and your deadlines and your checkbox for if you complete it and then you also have weekly tasks the next items are stickers and notepads the center one are notepads and then these are the um, different stickers for the planner. And I tried to get them all in watercolor theme because that is the theme of the planner I ultimately selected in the end. And next I have um, envelopes to add to the planner, pa pocket folders or envelopes for the planner, again in the watercolor design. So this is what all four of them look like on the outside. And this is how they are configured on the inside. And this is the planner I selected in the packaging that it comes in. Um, really not my favorite packaging because in the store I was trying to unseal it so that I could actually feel and look at the planner to make sure it's what I wanted. Um, before I purchase it. Now the back does show you what's in there, but I still just wanted to feel it for myself um, before I purchased it and like really look at it and handle it before I purchased it. So this is one of the zippered planners. There you go. That's your zipper opening and closing right there. On the inside here you have a pouch and then you have the pin holder. The first page is where you annotate who the planner belongs to and then you see you have your monthly tabs on the side. And this is where you start out with January and you have a space for your important info. Next you have your monthly goals and deadlines. Then you have your monthly spread with the uh, blank boxes for you to copy down your dates. Then at the top you have a space for weekly goals and you have important stuff down at the bottom right. And then this is your weekly spread. And then at the back of each month you have looking back, a space to copy notes for that. And then you have your looking ahead going into... The following months and so as you can see you have the um, gold rings and then it also has a gold zipper 
and then the back you also have a pouch same as the front and another pin holder.